It's 1999 in Baltimore City. Mayor Kurt Schmoke is wrapping up his third and final term in office when a Johns Hopkins student joins the staff as an intern. Everybody immediately liked him. I mean, he's one of wonderful personality. Schmoke says he remembers Wes Moore was interested in public service. He did all kinds of grunt work around the uh, office, never complained. A photographer happened to be in Schmoke's office one day when Moore joined him. Not often do some of the most important moments in your life get captured on camera like that. Uh, but that one did. That moment, Schmoke pointed to this photo, still hanging at his office at the University of Baltimore. I was pointing these guys out. I said, Wes, I think that's your future. <laughs> Him with a full head of hair, me with a full head of hair. And, um, but that was the moment when I first learned about the Rhodes Scholarship. Wes seemed to be the a kind of classic Rhodes Scholar because of a strong mind, strong body. Moore, a Hopkins football player, would ultimately receive a Rhodes Scholarship just like his mentor. When you combine the scholar-athlete, a commitment to the world's fight, this is a young man that would make a uh, classic road scholar. Had it not been for that interaction, and had it not been for the chance that I had that internship with Mary Schmoke where I got a chance to see how government worked for people on the ground, the impact of policy, uh, I just know my life would have been very, very different. I don't say I'm a feel like a proud papa, how about a proud uncle? <laughs> Smoke says he will be in Annapolis to watch Moore's historic inauguration. If anybody asks how I feel, I'll say I knew him before he was Wes Moore. <laughs> Wesley Moore back then, he'll be Maryland's first black governor. What's Baltimore's first elected black mayor think? He's n not a guy that's going to dwell on uh, the historical moment. Uh, I think he's looking to the future. Thank you. But, you know, take a moment and be uh, proud of the accomplishment and then start uh, moving forward. Schmoke says he won't offer any advice to his former intern. Problems and challenges, he says, are different today to when he left office decades ago. I just believe he'll focus like a laser beam on Maryland and uh, not worry about uh, the, the folks on the sideline that are whispering presidency, presidency. <laughs>